Today at Harper Guitar, we're going to be looking at the old Buddy Holly classic, Not Fade Away. But we'll be concentrating on the Rolling Stones version from the England's newest Hitmakers album. We'll get into the harmonica part and figure out what Brian Jones is doing there and how we can adapt that for the rack. Now, when Brian Jones is playing this on the album, he's swapping, he's playing two harmonicas. He'll start off when we're doing... He's got an A harmonica. And he'll play it on the shots with the with the rhythm. But now so what we're doing here on the first three shots, we're just doing a draw, draw two, three. And then on the fourth shot, we play the A, so we're gonna do a blow. And then back on the E, we'll draw. Draw, 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 blow, draw, 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 blow, draw. Now you can put some vibrato and you don't have to necessarily stand exactly true to that rhythm. Then it goes to A. So he, what, what Brian Jones is doing is he's swapping out and playing the next, he switches over to a D harmonica, which is second position harmonica for the key of A. Draw, 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 blow, draw. Exact same thing, just in a different harmonica. So he's going back and forth, back and forth. Hard to do if you're gonna do it all in the rack, right? So what we can do is we can stick to the D harmonica because the solo is done when we're in the key of A, for the most part. So looking at the solo part now, for the harmonica, it's going to start when we go to the A. So the guitar is doing that. So we're going to just comp that. We're going to do... Just doing the shots like we do during the other part. Okay, and then we come back. Guitar does the. We're going to put in the harmonics as well. So we come up to a draw five, back to a draw four. So we can get to that draw five, we can just right up to it or we can give a half bend draw four draw four draw five and then we're gonna go down the blue scale starting that draw four draw four single bend blow four then we end up a draw three single bend and then we're gonna slide up and then slide back down to a draw two I think, uh, you know, there's slight variations on each time Brian Jones plays that, so, but that's kind of the idea. So, now, those shots, now how do we fit that in? So, so those, draw four, that first shot, draw four, single bend, the second shot, blow four, the third shot, We got this draw three single bend that's in between shot. And there's two draw twos are on the A or the D. A. So this little up to the slide up to the draw five back to the draw four happens before our downbeat. That draw four is what happens on the downbeat. Now we're gonna go, the guitar is gonna go 
going to do this little solo riff on E. Normally, if we're playing it on the harmonica only, we can swap out to the other harmonica, but if we're in the rack, we can't do that. So what we're going to do is just play root notes, and we can play these root notes. Draw one. To draw two. Back to draw one. thing happens when we just go to the chord. So instead of playing the full chord, because we can't do that, because we're not swapping to the other harmonica, we can just stick to the root notes and we'll be okay. That way we can just stick to one harmonica and um, be able to handle the solo and the little bits in between. All right, that's how Brian Jones does it. He's got two harmonicas. He's using an A harmonica for when the, when the comping pattern here is an E, and he uses the D harmonica when it goes to A. All right, but we can do it with one. We can do it with the D harmonica. Right on. I want to tell you how it's going to be. You're going to give your love to me. Love that lasts more than one. 